We are just getting this in. One of the men convicted in the brutal beating of a San Francisco Giants fan was released from jail, but has just been arrested again. Marvin Norwood was sentenced to four years. Luis Sanchez got eight. I want you to listen to what the judge said about them. You are the biggest nightmare for individuals that attend public uh, events, such as sporting events or concerts. My son and I have season tickets to, uh, to football, uh, college football, and my biggest fear which is probably true for most of the people that, that, that appear there, and you don't have to stare at me, Mr. Sanchez, but I know you're paying attention to me, is that we run into people like you. Judge George Lomelli called them complete cowards who showed no remorse. That was during sentencing. No, it was released for time served. Our justice reporter Evan Perez has been following this, and he joins me now from Washington. Um, that was uh, what was Norwood charged with? Today? I said basketball beating earlier. It was baseball. I apologize for that. But uh, what was Norwood charged with today, Evan? Well, today he was charged with federal with federal gun charges. He was uh, uh, right after the uh, after this beating, the uh, the feds and, and the local officials there did a search of his home and they found several rifles, uh, pistols inside his house, a lot of ammunition. And today he he was charged with, with being a felon in possession of a firearm. So he could get up to ten years in federal prison if he is convicted on these charges. Don, the family, the Stowe family no doubt going to have high medical expenses. Who's going to pay for that? Well, yeah, I mean, the, 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 the Stowe family is, is going to have their, their lives changed by this. In court yesterday, the family said that uh, he can't even bathe himself. Uh, he was, a, he was a, a paramedic. He has two kids. Uh, it's, uh, his, their lives are forever changed, and they have high medical expenses, as you said. They're suing the Los Angeles Dodgers for, uh, for having lack security after this game. This is not the first time something like this had happened, obviously nothing like severely like this. Uh, but the, the Dodgers have increased security at these games. Uh, but obviously this family, it's too late for them, Don. All right. Evan Perez, thank you very much. Appreciate that.